So I know y'all have heard of Skillshare. And if not, let me put you on real quick, girl. So they're widely known for their classes in photography, film, video editing, illustration, graphic design. But did you know Skillshare has hundreds of career focused classes too? Yes, honey. And this new year is the perfect time to reinvent yourself, your goals, your career, and even your hobbies. And listen, as an entrepreneur of 10 plus years, it's definitely times where you lose inspiration, focus, you can just hit a plateau. But what's been helping for me is taking a break from the normal cycle of things and just learning something new, breaking out of the loop and learning something new to feed my creativity. Skillshare has classes in guided journaling, painting, and all types of different hobbies that not only feed your creativity, but they really feed your soul. And I've learned that soul care is such an important factor in entrepreneurship because your career is literally based off of you. So when you full and motivated and your spirit is feeling good and ready to go, everything you do will excel. I'm doing a little bit of everything, honey, you know, taking classes to help tap into my little artsy side, but also classes that's going to help me to focus and be more structured like this productivity and time management class. honey. Oh my gosh, so bomb. And it just really helps to give you a more structure around yourself and your career. So no more thinking small. It's time to tap into all those gifts and talents that you didn't even know was there. Okay, no go is too big. If you want to start a new business or you just want to do something you never imagined yourself doing, go for it. Now is the time, okay? Skillshare makes it so easy to learn something new. And good news, honey, the first 1,000 people to use the link below will get one month free of Skillshare, period go ahead and do yourself a favor get out of that box go ahead and click that link down below tap into something new and thanks again skillshare for sponsoring today's video Hey, 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 how y'all doing y'all? God is good, y'all, God is so, so, so good. I'm just so thankful for everything God has done, God is doing, and God will do. Y'all, God is just good. I cannot, I cannot, I cannot come on here and not tell y'all how good God is. But um, yeah, I hope y'all having a good day, y'all. I'm speaking nothing but blessings over your life clarity peace understanding even peace in your misunderstanding and i'm praying a peace that surpasses all understanding in your life just joy unlimited abundance like all of the things i am praying over your life i just want to thank y'all so much for just 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 thank y'all just thank y'all for being here thank y'all for watching thank y'all for just showing love y'all are more than youtube subscribers like we have really built a community over here for years really y'all been rocking with me for years of just us uplifting each other and i just feel like it's so many we got some fellas in the in the building we got our brothers too but of course like it's majority of us like that's just sisters you know supporting sisters and i just really want to show y'all some love appreciate love on y'all and let y'all know that i appreciate y'all so 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 much like i just be thanking god i be thanking god I be thanking God for y'all. Y'all just make this whole thing, this whole journey even more amazing. Um, just all the love, all the support, the, the stories, how we just talk to each other. The comment section is always just so full of love. And I appreciate y'all for that, for real. It's a blessing. So um, anyway, welcome back y'all to another vloggy vlog. What is do y'all? It is Friday, freaky Friday. Okay, we out on the street. And I am going actually to do some hair, honey. So y'all come with me, day in the life of a traveling hairstylist. <laughs> and I'm kind of starting something new with my cosmetology title. Um, I don't know, I just get so bored working behind a chair. Like it's just a cycle for me. I just get so bored. I start it and then I'll just like get unpassionate about it. But you know, ooh, camera shaky bakey. Hold on. We trying a little something new with this uh tripod 
y'all i got a tripod sitting on the floor okay so it's real ghetto i'm trying to drive smooth <laughs> but y'all may bump around a little bit okay but anyway so um i just I don't know i noticed that i just get stagnant in my career being a hairstylist and but god showed me a long time ago that it was a purpose for me being in this field but it wasn't gonna be like just the usual it wasn't gonna be me just you know and it's a blessing to be able to do hair and and you know it's, it's a blessing to be able to have this gift and be able to work behind the chair and own a salon and all of that. It's such a blessing. But God showed me that I would be doing like unique things with, you know, my my hairstylist career, my hairstyling career. And so, um, and, and you know, I've just always felt called to like do something different. Um, years ago, I worked in this ministry hair group we was called um i reached 2035 shout out to my girl sierra okay she made this group and we went out and just did hair for um at the homeless shelters we went to like the children shelters like and we just did hair and honestly i always reflect on that and that was like the happiest times of my career like doing things for free like honestly when i get into this cycle of just like promoting and, and you know like you know making revenue and just having like a game plan going to make money it just don't feel as good you know and so i pray and i ask god to just show me what i need to do who i need to be who i need to connect with in order to make like in order to use my gift for free you know what i'm saying like god will provide at the end of the day that's why i don't get caught up in this loop of life like oh i gotta make money i gotta be a millionaire i used to think like that you know but i got out of that loop because god is my provider seek ye the kingdom of god first and all these things will be added unto you like if you walking in your purpose you asking god for direction on what you we gonna talk more about this later right now i gotta get going i got about an hour and 30 minute drive ahead of me but first we gotta stop up here at the salon i gotta get like a few more hair tools and hair products for my hair bag where i'm going today and yeah i'm just excited about all the things we walk into let's walk in that's all brandon oh hey betty b hey look at my pool betty b in the collect all right my boy i'm out this thing all right thank you see you later love y'all oh wait let me make sure this open this is good okay see ya trj beauty studio and we're off on the road we got a couple orders as well and yeah we off we out this thing let's go do some hair Out. Yes. This is her year, this is her time. 
Okay. okay. 2023, what you say, please? Okay, 2023 is for me. It's for me. Okay. It's for me. Okay. Okay. No excuses. No excuses. No Pouring everything. Just Pouring it all into it. ourselves. Yeah. Get into it. My girl is so, so cute. Yeah. Yes, honey buns. Yes. Honey, honey, y'all know what it means. When the wig gets snatched, we tired, y'all. Okay, day is done. Y'all, I'm so tired, but I'm so happy. So happy with how her hair turned out. It was so cute. I love doing hair. I just love it. I love it. Um, and I just be so fulfilled when I, you know, I just be looking at my work like, you know, like I did that, like, you know. But y'all, I done stopped um, in Atlanta to JJ's fishy chicken chat. I said, I gotta come and give me some good food cause I'm hungry. I got a whole, let me see how long I got to get home. And I already drove probably a good little 30 minutes. So yeah, I got 33 more minutes till home, which is not, not far, not bad. I just have a feeling I'm not supposed to be here. I turned around, I don't like turning around to go back to what I said I wasn't gonna go back to. Cause I was like, no, I'm not gonna stop. Cause you know, it's late. Um, I'm in the hood. Like, you know, like I just, I'm by myself. Like I'm not gonna stop and get no damn fish. But yet, I, I didn't stop to get some fish. Cause I just wanted it that bad. But um, you know, just being watchful. Being watchful. Have your surroundings child. And uh, getting in and out. I done already seen the young man with the gun on his hip. Like, I'm just ready to go. I'm ready to go. I used to love the streets, okay? When I was my little, little tenderoni age, my little 14, 15, you know, 16 year old era, I love the streets. But listen, I ain't got time. I done been in the street. I done been. He just got a gun hanging out his. Like why? It's conceal carry. Conceal your weapon. Why are you rocking around showing everybody this gun? Lord, get me up out of here. And then he got the mask on. Like why do you even just want to go out scaring people like that? You got the whole face ski mask on with a gun hanging out your pants. Why? The city <laughs> is so pretty. Mm -hmm. The city is so pretty. I'm driving through the downtown. Why don't it take us? Good. Y'all still at school. I, I, I had to go and um, work, honey child. <laughs> but the city is just so beautiful. I love running through Atlanta. Even though the traffic, I don't like. It's late, so it ain't no traffic. Of course. Wait, right see. What? So, uh, I had to walk home and he was a little mad. Why? Because TT. Well, TT was going to. Like, he only had to walk for like 30 seconds. Oh. And then he was bad because TT didn't pick him up. But then she started driving and she seen him. And he's like, in the car. Lordy Jesus, but you guys. I'm hey. vlogging. I'm vlogging. I got my oh. JJ fishing trigger. And I'm driving to my camera to show y'all. Yeah. Oh, it's so bomb. It was definitely worth it. It was definitely worth being in the hood and by myself, watching this man with a gun swing off his head. It was worth it. It worked for me. I felt like I was with my people. Mm -hmm. I was with my people. They were looking out. I got me some hush puppies. Oh my God, so good. But I'm about to go home. That is the end of this vlog. I'm tired. Thank y'all for watching. Day in the life of a traveling hairstylist. Headed back to my parts, y'all. Uh, back to the Gwinnett, okay? That's it, though, y'all. It's 9.42 p.m., so I'm about to get off of here. Let me turn this light off while I'm driving. That's not safe. But, yeah, I'm about to get off here. I'm headed home. Home sweet home. 20 minutes to go. Thanks for hanging out with me today on this little day in the life of traveling hairstylist. Oh, that's what I wanted to tell y'all. So, um, 
what I was saying in the beginning of the vlog when I got rudely interrupted with my tripod, my ghetto tripod hanging and swinging, was that um, I'm definitely adding traveling to my services. Actually, the whole TRJ Beauty team is adding traveling services, okay? So, y'all make sure to check us out. We do travel. If you want that luxurious home visit experience, I'm going to bring you a silk robe, comfy slippers, you know, some complimentary stuff so you can be comfortable at home and cute while you get your hair done. And we also offer a whole, you know, our package deals with makeup, hair, photo shoots, weddings, video shoots, events, all of that, y'all. Check us out. We are, you know, walking into some new things. Um, and I definitely want to, I have some more exciting things planned for us as a team. Our outreach program. Um, we just got a lot of things that we are about to get into. So, y'all make sure to stay tuned. Visit my website, airjbeauty.com. So y'all can see everything we be up to. Follow the whole team. They are so talented. Everybody travels. So, and I think that's just a new vibe. Like, when you just can get your services in-house. Like, I know personally, I have kind of, like, chilled on my whole maintenance things. Because I just do not like getting out, driving, going to different places to get cute. You know, like, I would just, I honestly prefer if I could have a team of people come to me. <laughs> and that's actually what I'm about to do for my lashes. This girl... Um, she offers like traveling services and she'll come to you in your house. And I'm like, that is what I'm talking about. That's what we getting into. Okay. Stay home. Stay comfy. You know what I'm saying? Come to me. So if you want to fly me out, drive me out, you know what I'm saying? To get slayed. Go ahead and book a player. Book a sister. Book your girl. I am available. Accepting new clientele. And like I said, stay tuned because we got a lot of new exciting things planned. I honestly am going to be doing a lot of free hair. Y'all heard it. Yes, free. So yeah, I want to have like some models and everything for some projects I'm working on. And honestly, just to give back. Like I like to do hair just because I like to do it. It's one of my many passions. So you know, hit me up. Hit me up. I'm going to have some more information coming soon. But yeah, y'all. All right. I'm running my mouth at this point. I know y'all probably tired of looking at the road. <laughs> And yeah, I'll catch y'all in the next video. Thanks so much for watching. Love y'all so much. Stay safe. God bless y'all. Make sure to listen to your intuition. Um, I'm praying so many good things for y'all in 2023. I just want to encourage y'all to step out on faith with anything that you want to do. I encourage y'all to just not even stick to the usual this year. Okay, step out. If you've been having a unique idea and vision for your life and for your business, for your family or whatever, step out on faith and do it because everything you need is designed for you and only you only you can do that unique thing that is placed in your heart and in your head and in your mind and your spirit only you can do it only you can bring it to life so it's for you to do it's your purpose it's your gift it's your talent and walk in it walk confidently in it so yeah speaking great things for us in 2023 love y'all so much and i'll catch y'all in the next video peace out